Hello, Michael here again from Michael's Helping Hand. Today I'm going to show you how to make a carousel uh, in your website. So let's head on over to the example website in Canva. So here we have a three page website that I just made. Well, that I just got the template for. I just chose three pages. And now what we're going to do is add a page. So it doesn't really matter what the background is. I'm gonna come over here. And we're going to type in PRE for presentation. And once it's done loading, we will add some pictures. And if you want, you can add buttons or whatever else to it. Uh, the button you could add to another link that would pop up some text or uh, pop up a bigger picture or just whatever you decide. Or it could go to uh, an Instagram page or YouTube page or whatever it may be. So we are going to, why not? Let's do this one. Feature technology. And I don't really care if it's a uh, Canva background. So we're going to add another one. Make it look a little bit different. Uh, let's do this one. And do one with a button. All right. So we got three. And where is the button? Ah, here we go. There's the button. Okay. So if you want to add something to this, uh, what we'll do, we'll do, uh, two links. So this, 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 and then you'll click here and you'll go to another page. So let's do another presentation also, and we'll just say hello. Well, that's loading. I'm going to fix a little bit of instant copy. All right. And just press T for text. Hello. Make it bigger. Very big. Hello. Just like that. All right. Now, what we're gonna do is share and then embed. Let's do that a little bit slower. So go down here after you hit share. So more embedded, like embedded. And you can share this with HTML code, or you can share it with another page. And we're going to do another page. And then we'll come into here, and we will add it not only to the button, but also to the text. So it doesn't matter if you click on the text or the button. And then 
faith. Faith. All right, so now I will delete that. Not another page. All right, so now this is a link. The page and another page. So what we are going to do is do the same thing. Embed. Copy it. Or no. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then go into here. And this time, we are going to embed on this part. <clears throat> so click in your apps. There's the embed. Ah, here we go. Embeds. You could just type it in, but I was too lazy. So add design. <clears throat> and now you have a carousel. We can add it. To the whole page. There we go. I'm gonna put it far down. Yeah, there we go. All right. So now when we preview it, Light. And we have our carousel. So click over, click over. Where's my button? There we go. And then we can click it. So we'll click it and it will open another page. Hello. So that's how you add a carousel and you can add buttons into your carousel. Uh, yes, it will pop open another page, but at least you have multiple pages that you can add to your website. And that's okay. Some websites are like that. Some websites are internal. So Either way is fine. And you can still buy stuff. You can still uh, add videos. You can still do all kinds of stuff with it. It's still going to be interactive. It's just another way of doing it. All right. Well, I hope you liked this video of the carousel. Uh, and... Next time, I'll show you something new and exciting that you can do. And you can add as many uh, pages that you want to the carousel. It, it's basically unlimited. Now, I, I would do maybe uh, 10 at the most because you, know, you don't want to keep scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and scrolling with hundreds of different pages. Uh, well, I think the only way that you would do that is with a house, like a house, not a house website, um, real estate website where you have hundreds of houses. But then I would do like condo and then house. And then so it's split up into like maybe 20 or 30 houses, something like that. And then you could click on the button and it would take you to the form and then you would contact the real estate place. And that's how you could build a real estate site pretty easily. It would just take a little bit of work. Well, a lot of work, if that's a lot of pages, but yeah.
uh, there's a carousel for you. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, and wait for more stuff to come out. Uh, in the future, I'll do stuff not just on websites, but resumes, business cards, logos, uh, CVs, all, all kinds of stuff. Because this is Mike's helping hand and we take care of all that kind of stuff. <laughs> all right. Have a wonderful Christmas, and I will see you guys later. So happy holidays, and also happy new year if I don't see you before new year. <laughs>